Here at Tiffany Regional Medical Center, um, the technology for devices has uh, continued to evolve. Um, there is remote monitoring that, uh, for each of the manufacturers that we utilize. And, and what that means, it allows us to evaluate a patient with a device at a distance uh, from home or actually I have patients that travel with their, uh, these remote monitoring devices and even from a motel room, uh, I'm able to evaluate their pacemaker or defibrillator and uh, in the setting of symptoms or questions, be able to address those. So uh, that's been one of the very good things that's happened with uh, technology over the last few years. When I insert a pacemaker, again, oftentimes that's for pac uh, patients that have slow heart rhythms. They may have symptoms of dizziness, uh, feelings of like they may pass out and or pass out. So we insert a uh, pacemaker leads then into the heart. When I insert a defibrillator, then that is a patient that usually has had a heart attack oftentimes or heart muscle weakness. Again, depending on whether they have slow heart rates or rhythms, and the severity of the heart muscle weakness, then we may put in a one, two, or three lead device. In the end here at the Heart Massacre Center, with cardiac rhythm management, I feel patients and their families can have full confidence that they can get state-of-the-art care close to home.